get that day. Shut up, Norman. Hero of the hunt. No, you are not. The Guardian. Cessna 365 now, 1500. We are heading for the hunt. Negative. Disregard that last transmission. Okay, you need to return to the Guardia. Negative, that was transmitted in error. Take your hand off the mic, Norman. We are going down. No, we are not. We can get a view. You want to try to land runway 13? Negative, everything's fine here. We're continuing as planned. That's it, Norman. I'm plugging out your intercom circuit breaker. Birds. What the deuce? Oh, shit balls! No. Fuck her. Listen, where are you? Where's that? I'm coming! Shut up, Norman. Shit. Stop the stopwatch. And up we go. Oh! When you. Oh, he's having a baby. He's, he's, he's lost. Just. He's rocking back and forth. Look. So I have to start the whole shot again now, the whole thing all over again, and I said tonight. 07020 knots, and I'm facing right into the window. New York helicopter terminal, and I can't remember the name of the fucking place, so now I have to go look it up. Hmm. Here we are in Manhattan heliport, and we're going to take off with this micro light. We're going to climb to the top of the building three times, come back, and then start, stop the stopwatch. So, where's my stopwatch? Bollocks. Engine. I've hit the I've hit the right prop on the runway. Just go down, just touch it. There we go. Good. Oh whoa. Am I alive? Oh Jesus Christ! Where's the runway? There it is. Oh yeah, there we go. We're gone. We're gone. That's what happens. Go below blue line speed in an engine failure. Come on, this one. Hitch dead, there you go. Top's coming up, hold it level. Is it gonna stall? Otherwise. Oh no! Don't do this to me! It's too late! It's too late! Just don't stall and go into the water! Oh my god! That is. Fuck! Adding power. And up we go. Oh, I missed it! Shit! I fucking crashed. Oh, this looks really bad. Brace for it. I've got to try and stop this before the end. No, try not. Do or do not. Oh, thank God. Yoda, you are so wise. Nothing more will I teach you today. At last, I'm going to steal an airplane. Yeah. Oh, yeah. You okay? Yeah, can I have a look around? You can. Can I help you? Are these keys for assessors? There we go, nice simple start. In real life, when you're flying, you've got your life in your hands. So it's very, very important, obviously, to have the appropriate licensing, the appropriate training, including safety training, etc., etc. Whereas when you're at home in your flight simulator, there's no risk at all. Okay, she wouldn't even shake my hand at this point. It was going very, very badly, and I had probably made a fool of myself. But then it dawned on me the four magic words I have a jet. How long do they fly with this ship? We go around Wicklow a little bit. Oh no, but when we will change the plane, you know, for the private jet, what you told me, champagne. Oh yeah, uh, I lied. Hello, everybody, and uh, today is a very, very special video. Uh, we're going to announce the winners of the shout out competition. This next channel is called Reaction Review, and I've got to say, uh, for an X-Plane channel, uh, this guy is putting in a lot of work. All right, I'm going to hit subscribe on his channel, and you should as well. up again I'm way too high and I've got to do the whole shot all over again which is fucking fantastic recording sound no where's rain where is king rain gone fucker this doesn't stop now I'll have to do this take all over again and I won't be happy I'll not be happy please stop please don't make me do this all over again it's late at night Please stop. We're driving it in a bit. Hold on, hold it up. Oh, right. That one up. And now I have to do the whole shot all over again. 
Brilliant. Fantastic. Mmm. Very nice. Very nice. Floaty, floaty landing. That was not a floaty, floaty landing. And I'm way off the runway and I have to do the whole shot all over again. Brilliant. Just fantastic. That's just brilliant, that is. Okay, I can't seem to fly this at all. Oh, it's gone. It's gone. I've bust the gene in it. Um, okay, I don't feel very comfortable looking at this at all. I think we need something that can handle the force, the G-forces that are applied. I sense much fear in you. Oh, God, he's back. I shouldn't have said force. How embarrassing. You know, the aircraft kept coming apart because it couldn't take the G-force. <laughs> You'll be laughing when I get this down without the force, Yoda. You are reckless. Maybe, but look what I'm going to fly. Mm. No, I'm too heavy. I need to drop those fuel tanks. Or two, see what you can do back there. <laughs> okay, it looks like I can, I can just about keep it. Oh, Use the fast. oh God, Obi Wan is here as well. Okay, it's looking good. It's looking good. Oh, bloody hell. Stay on target. Stay on target. Of course now I'm doing floaty floaty. This is just not gonna do. Okay, you're gonna have to take the flaps up and drop the lift. Oh! Ooh. Okay, 140 knots. Hopefully I'll start by the end of the runway, but I'm not too sure. Now, that seems to have done it. So, Yoda, what do you think? See through you, we can. That may be so, but the F A eighteen has a much higher G force tolerance. How can this be? It's G force, Yoda. Mm. Uh, it's nothing to do with your forces. Dangerous and disturbing. This look. Let, let's be quick about this. There's the dark side of the force, your side of the force, and G force. No. no. We also have a G force, but nobody can find it. <laughs> Time for murder, death, kill. bombs will actually drop. I've highlighted it for you. Oh, it's Sam. Sam, Sam, Sam. How dare he interrupt my tutorial. Bombs away. This is the Pint gelungen, the Front and Breitner Formation to speak. In the south, the Gegner has been taken and stößt on Stahnsdorf. With the Angriff Steiners. And that's all in order. My Führer. Steiner. Steiner konnte nicht genügend Kräfte für einen Angriff massieren. Der Angriff Steiner ist nicht erfolgt. Das war ein Befehl! Der Angriff Steiner war ein Befehl! Niederträchtiger Treiner ist erfolgt! Yes, I don't like trains particularly. I don't like them, I just don't like trains. Must be something to do with this freak. <gasps> oh, this is brilliant. Don't... Oh no. I didn't get the train itself. Cheeky bastard. If it's the last thing I do... Oh, brilliant, now my engine's dead. Okay, I'm going to do a kamikaze. I'm going to shoot the bejesus out of him, and I'm going to I'm going to ram him. I'm going to ram him. I'm going to take the two of us out at the same time. You're going down, you bastard. Yes, I'm going to get you now. This is just humiliating. There we go. Chop it all the power. Chop it all the power. Bollocks. Okay, it looks like we're gonna make it. Power off, it's gonna bounce really hard. Ooh, a bit of a bounce. 
Bit of a bounce. Now, it's not over yet. I've got to steer the aircraft and then reverse thrust. I'm using asymmetrical thrust again just to steer it. No, go off the runway. I can't use reverses until I have it straight. Right, reverse. Oh, 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 bollock! That's sweet. That's... That's what that looks like. Brilliant. Fantastic. Oh yeah, now I've had power and it's crashed. Brilliant. That's the whole thing all over again. Fantastic. Reverse thrust on. Yeah, brilliant. And that's what happens. That's... That's... That's what happens. Oh, I don't believe it. Why won't this work? Oh, it's gonna be a hard one. Now I have to do it. All over again. It's got all the cameras. And yeah, this is this is just fabulous. <laughs> okay, that's okay. Now, let it roll out. No, oh, Yoda, I'm so embarrassed. I'm so mm. busy looking outside and ignore the instruments. Still looking to the horizon. Never hear that. I know, Yoda. All my attention was diverted to making a video. You did my words not, did you? I used to reverse thrust with the props out of sync. I failed. The greatest teacher failure is... Oh, you're just peddling easy answers. Pass on what you have learned. I've done it. Success. Hooray! A bit of a bouncy bouncy there, but everything's fine. I've organized it's all good. Okay, breaky breaky break. Oh, not too much breaking, not too much breaking. <laughs> I have it all under control. Nothing bad's going to happen. Everything's fine. Bucker! This brings new meaning to ski slopes. Let's go. Sure, everyone's dead anyway. The aircraft's heavier on the ground, so. Okay. Um. Uh, okay. Um. Let's let's just get it started up really, uh, really quickly, shall we? Let's just move on. By some miraculous miracle, I seem to have survived my egotistical madness. My legs badly damaged as I neglected to read and understand section 5 of the Cessna Operating Handbook, page 5 dash one leg performance. Perhaps I could crawl. What? Oh, you again. Please. Oh, no. Is that you, Gentle Ben? Oh, thank God, Gentle Ben. Greetings everybody and welcome to yet another Sunday stream and this week uh, we're in the north of Italy and mountainous crazy madness and as you can see by the title um, and how are you? I hope you're getting on well folks. Uh, I've had a turn of heart this week. I think I might be in a slightly odd mood because I'm flying the L39. Uh, yes, the L39, I think it's a C version, I'm not too sure. Uh, I've just, <laughs> I haven't actually, I flew, oh, what's going on here? We've got this, this choppy nonsense going on again, have we? No, 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 let me get rid of this window here and that might fix it. Never goes well, never, there, yeah, okay. Sorry, folks. So, hope you're all doing well. Yeah, slightly odd mood, L39, and, uh, yeah, we're, we're I, I'm going to, look, look. At least I get there first, so this week we can watch you all land, do you know? Uh, so everybody's very welcome. The L39C, uh, we have many, many, many people with us. You're all very welcome. Uh, <clears throat> yes, uh, I'll read some of you that I can see. We've got Nighthawk, 
in car, uh, copper hat, uh, a few bunched up, I can't see, a Florida fella, uh, flying midge, raptor X, uh, two three Sierra, all man, baker fly, captain hook, welcome captain hook, I haven't seen you, I don't think I've seen you here before, no I haven't, but it's a good name, captain hook, uh, also, <laughs> maybe that's just the traffic I'm reading there folks, anyway, uh, Rally Roach, I'm not too sure, uh, there's a Ryanair flight there going past up there, look. That's a Ryanair flight. Yeah, I see. I've got the traffic. Maybe they update. They fix the traffic. Hmm. There's Colonel Clink way down the bottom. Uh, Bravo India. Yeah, they, I think. They, I think these are just people flying around. Most of them. Captain Cook, Baker Fly. Uh, anyway, I'll re when we're on the way, I will mention all your names and uh, great. So yeah, they're obviously. <coughs> that's obviously uh, just traffic going about its business. They're not watching our stream. So yes, yeah, thirty nine. <laughs> I had the uh, honor uh, of flying this in America uh, for the day. Yeah, uh, they're a Czech trainer, military trainer. And um, it's, I suppose, the, 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 the pilot in command, I think he took it easy on me. We did some stuff, you know, we did all the usual loop-the-loops and barrel rolls and pulled some Gs and high-speed turns. And yeah, I enjoyed it immensely. Uh, yeah, so... <laughs> I'm gonna fly in the sim today. And I have forgotten everything, of course. I really have. Uh, who's up beside you? Oh, that looks nice. So a few of you are flying jets. Now, uh, the only reason I'm flying a jet is because uh, I'm in a slightly odd mood. And at least I get there early so I can watch all the rest of you land. You know, because I'm always paddy last. Now, if I crash, which is likely, I can catch up with you all, you know? Let's have a look at some of the comments before Colonel Click comes on. Uh, let's have a look at YouTube first. So look at YouTube comments first. David Heath, hello. Cloppy D, uh, hello to you. Ian Pollard, Windage. Uh, Equinus is here with us. David Taylor, Shady, hello, is with us. And Shady says, forgot to download the update. Uh, got about 1.5 gigabytes to go. I know, Shady. I kind of, earlier on today, I said, I better check. Because I haven't been on all week. I better check if there's been an update. And who had there was. So I'm on time, at least. Because, you know, I was trying to avoid anything going wrong with the stream <laughs> so uh, let's hop inside let's have a close look there's a load of these with flight sim uh, it's not actually the same it's the same aircraft type but there's all little bits and pieces that are different like the cockpit can be quite different uh, my monitor you can't see this thankfully my monitor is about to break folks I think I'm getting all sorts of weird uh, things going on here I'll have to get our it's just a cheap TV. It's a, it's a cheap television I'm using. You know, uh, it's not up to scratch at all. There's a big jet, and let's hop to the cockpit. Come on, mm, the button didn't work, so I have to activate the screen, and I have to press this button here. Right, folks. Uh, okay, I didn't read the other comments. I didn't read Twitch's comments, or who's on Twitch. I'm just reading who's. I know, I can't read everyone who's watching. But I can tell you who's commenting. So anyway, Tritz is a side gripper, Colonel Clink, and of course, but she's her buttons. She's her buttons is outside the garden because it's still bright, and she's chasing butterflies and getting up to mischief, probably chewing up all those boxes I put out the back garden. Oops. Anyway, uh, how are you all? Nothing to worry about. Uh, nothing bad is going to happen. Everything will be fine. Uh, thank you, Tritz. Spud, uh, Spud. Hi, everyone. Happy Father's Day and Dad's in the USA. Absolutely. Robert Times. Uh, hello, all, he says. Spun Dot's with us. Uh, we've got Robert Times. I think I mentioned that. 23 Sierra. Hello, how are you as well? Uh, 23 Sierra. Good evening, says Quaggy UK. Mazak. Uh, 234 is on. Jason is on as well. Evo 5. I'm probably repeating myself. Uh, DCS Ducks and Goofy RS is in the chat. Great, folks. Let us uh, begin. Where's Carla Clink though? Have I got my Skype open? I do. Will I ring Colonel Clink for a change, folks? Will I actually do? Well, I'll call him, right? I will call Colonel Clink. Uh, I press this button here. That's the sound. Let's see if Colonel Clink answers. Hurry up, chop, chop. Greetings and salutations. And salutations and greetings to you as well, Colonel Clink. Where, come on. What, what is this? What is get, this? We've got to get going. Chop, chop. Hel hel hello, everybody. Hello, everybody. <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm rushed here. Why am I rushed? What's, uh, what, yeah. what's, what's happening? <laughs> I said I'd <laughs> ring you first. For first time ever, uh, Ripper Sim has called Colonel Clink. Uh, 
And I put Colonel Clink on the spot. I uh, just thought I'd have a bit of crack. I'm in a slightly odd mood today, Colonel Clink. Okay, okay, that's that's yes. that's fine. I, I I just managed to start the engine of me Kodiak today. I'm 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 very boring today. Ah. Yeah. Well, um, I am going to start taxiing. Yeah, so so do I. I I got my taxi information here, and I tried to find my way. Uh, I don't know where I am. Where where are we? Uh, you're in you're in Ireland. Uh, you're in Dublin, somewhere. Uh, uh, no. Your name is Colonel Clink, and I think it will be fine. I think that's going to happen. Park I, break off. I I thought I was in the left seat of the aircraft. Ten flaps. <laughs> <laughs> It's tough. Uh, yeah. Now let's taxi away. So, come on, Park. Come on. Nothing go wrong. Nothing go wrong. Come on. Oh, I don't know what my gear is, but oh, it doesn't matter. Uh, now, yeah, I haven't flown this since the races. Actually, I flew this in the races. I have oh, to get back to the racing at some point. You 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 flying a racing plane? Yeah, the L thirty nine. I flew you, it in real life. Are you are you trying to get get wherever we going before us? Yes. Uh, and and because I'm in a slightly odd mood. Yeah, uh, that that ain't gonna happen. Know. You know that. Well, we'll see. It's uh, like you know, you, you're uh, gonna. I, get I intend. I intend to fly low. It's busy here. Uh, I intend to fly low. You're gonna get lost. And, oh, can I just stop here for a minute, folks? Okay, I'm just just halt here. I'll tell you why now in a second, right? Do you hear that? Do you hear the voices in the background? Do you hear those voices? Yeah, FS realistic. They don't have. Let's see. I don't seem to have. Uh, I have to get rid of the people. Because <laughs> it's like. What? I have the crowd. You know the the, the crowd or uh, in FS Realistic? Yeah. So I have people, cabin ambience. Let's switch that off. Oh. There we go. I don't think they need that in a jet. Right. Continuing to taxi. So you're flying. Some through people at home might be hearing voices and then might be getting freaked out, going, "Oh my God, it's all over! I've lost my mind already." So your flight instructor gives a lot of noise. If they had yeah, exactly. Yeah, exactly. So it's I'm like taxiing a runway. Uh, I don't know what runway we're taxiing. It's uh, going to be. Where is my? Uh, okay, we're going to take off on the southerly runway. We'll be heading south-ish. Are we? Yes. That's. I don't know about the winds. It's uh, like. I'm not too sure, but I can't see windsock anywhere. It's. It's like a long taxi. Like you know, I'm. I'm taxiing here for half an hour. Yeah, I'm gonna. Ta I'm gonna turn around now or early. Uh, I'm gonna turn around early. I'm gonna come to a halt before I approach the runway. Just say, say who's behind and give everyone else a chance to catch up. Uh, so I'm gonna halt here. But what I should really do is what I do in the real world is this. No, that's fine. I've done it. Um, you know, look out for any incoming aircraft. Blah, 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 blah. Now, let's have a look outside, folks, before it's, we go. It's like uh, one one thing I have to say. I don't I don't know nothing about today's flight plan. The Hoover uh, or Florida fella uh, yep. supplied this today for us. Yes, Florida fella, thank you very much. We are very grateful for this. It's like uh, and nothing bad is going to happen. I have no doubts about that whatsoever. Yeah. There's everyone queuing up. Uh, there's a, let's have a quick increase the camera speed there. So there's a lot of people. Oh, yeah, they're going down the other runway. Okay, well, I'll have to just go. Right? I, I, so I only see behind. a few fluffy clouds, so that should be fine then. Lovely weather. Yeah. We're in uh, Italy, maybe now, aren't we? Milan. Near Milan. Milan. Milan, the airport so called Milan something. Are we going to get the Milanese then? The, the what now? A Milanese. It's some sort of pizza, isn't it? I don't know. I don't know. I haven't it's spent a, a lot of time in Italy. I was there in 1990 and I was there actually oh, I was there a few years ago. I, I flew into Italy, I think. I did. Have you, have you been in the Colosseum yet? Yes, many, many years ago. Uh, it's fantastic, right. isn't it? Power on. Yep. Power on, everything is good. Full bar. I don't oh, know where the I, 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 I don't know where the runway is. I'm still taxing like a madman here. Okay, well I'll, I'll oh, I see you. I'll I'll fly over you. Okay. What's this gonna be? Oh no! My uh, controls! You broke it already. No, I haven't got my, my Thrustmaster and I'm using the the girly uh I, I want my stick to work. Okay. There you are. 
I need a stick. There's got to click there, folks. So I'll do that as I'm flying, okay? Look at the sounds. Now, I'm going to hit escape. I'll probably disappear, okay? Because I'm using my actual... I hit escape. I'm going to pause for everybody in the air now. Controls options. That was very annoying. Why don't they just slave all the controls to the aircraft? Like yep. X-Plane. That would be like uh, uh, thinking ahead. Yeah, you just have to set it up once, Bob's your uncle, and you're done. Yeah. It makes me sad. Uh, Warthog. Uh, no, that's the throttle. No, I want the... Warthog. Now, I'm going to switch off the Yoko the Oak. You don't want to do this in a really fly. I'll put that to set disabled. It's the only way to do it. Folks, so just disabled. At least... And then... At least yeah. I'm not the only one. I, I just came across Vintage here. He's trying to figure out where the runway is as well. <laughs> now, now to, uh, let's activate Toby. Yes, well, we're, we're... Oh, we're not. Yes, we are. We're good. Oh, don't start. It's just busy. See, when I take off these busy airports, yeah. there's lots of other traffic here, plainly. Um, there's like loads of stuff which um, it seems to be uh, generated traffic, like uh, real world traffic. Oops. Yep. Lots of traffic, so the, the, the only choppiness that will go very soon. Okay, let's go. So I think that's enough time for everybody. I think everyone's in the air. Looks Absolutely. Like. Oh, there you not. go. There's Sarah Paul, there's Captain Hook, there's Marvin Biggins. Uh, there's lots. There's Johnny F. He's taxiing as well. He's in the Hawk. You catch up easy because I'm gonna go flow f slower for those of you in Baron 58 and whatnot. For the moment. Now let us see. Uh, I got about half power. Let's see what heading I want. I want a heading of around 300. Uh, uh, that's what we have roughly. Yeah, we have 300. Wow. That's, that really look well. I can see the compass. Okay, we're off. Now I'm gonna take my gear up. So we can speed up. Will G work? Yes. Gears coming up. And flaps are coming up. Where is my speed? Oh, there it is. 126 knots. Right, let's add some power. Let's get moving in this puppy. Oh, oh, lots of trimming required. Lots of trimming. Okay. Lots of trimming. This is apparently a big airfield. It is. Lots of trimming. Moving up to 200 knots now. I'm going to pop my head up a little bit higher. There's Marvin Biggins down there in the barn. He's doing the same with his controls, it looks like. He's just, he's just sitting there in the air. That's because he's in the main menu, folks. Hmm. So it looks like we're following this river. So where are you now, Karen Clink? I'll slow down a little bit just No, to I'm still taxing. I don't know where the runway is. <laughs> oh, come, come now. <clears throat> uh, oh my God, another update. Yes, folks, I know. We got you all by surprise. Don't worry, I'll catch you. The update for me took about 15 minutes. Uh, now, it usually takes longer than that. I'm well, just going to do an orbit here for everyone, well, okay? You, you probably haven't done all the updates for the update. Oh, for America? No, I happen to the boss. Yeah, no, there you just go. The bare bones. Well, there's, we don't there's, need America. There, there's updates for everything. There's uh, Europe updates and updates here and updates left, right, and center. Really? Yeah. So I'm doing orbits here. Let's look outside. Just waiting for everybody else to catch up. Uh, lovely airplane. Tom Cruise. Oh, no, he flew. I watched a video with Tom Cruise and he's got his own P 51 Mustang. He's, he flies one of these. They're very popular. I mean, I flew when I thought it was... Uh, I think they're just popular it's because you can own a jet, you know? Uh, a trainer jet. A military trainer. Um, which is nice. There's Johnny F taking off there. And there's AH. Where is Colonel Are you taking off or are you still taxiing? No, I'm still taxiing, but I think I've found the runway now. Let's see what's Colonel Cake's up to, folks. And some some big jet is there. Like, he's turning around now. Like, you know, you just get off. Now, I'm going to take off straight after that big jet and just want to see if they have the turbulence. There's Colonel Clink. Look yeah. at this. Colonel Clink. 
Paddy lost. I know. Shame on you. I know. It looks like they fixed the gen the traffic. I don't know. Uh, there's going to be. Go on. Off you go. We're watching you. We're watching you. Uh, it's okay. Because my airplane's moving, it's very hard for me to move the camera. I have to. Okay, better go back to my airplane. Reset cap. Probably crashing into the ground. No, no, I'm doing orbit still. We fly by Colonel Clink, folks. Let's do fly by. Do we know Colonel Clink? Oh, there was some G's pulled there, I would say. Oh, we have to find a G meter in this, folks. There's got to be a G meter. So we're going to come down and we're going to we're going to fly over Colonel Clink. Now, I'm going to get my camera as well for you folks so you can see what I'm doing with the controls. Do that with cruise. Take all the power packs if going too fast. 240, 50 knots already. Let's go down and activate our Toby. There's current the clink there at the beginning of the runway. Oh. You hear him? There's current clink. Now, current clink, you will see something outside your front window very shortly. Okay. And it will displease you. There you go. That's me. Good, good, good. And upside down. No! Oh, I can assume there's something really, really weird. I was bouncing off the ground. Did I get away with it? Uh, that was uh, done on purpose entirely. Uh, oh, I have no gear. I can't fake that one. <laughs> uh, well, the engines are shutting off. Are they? I stuffed it up. I stuffed it up. I was too low. Too cheeky. That's what happens. Now, what's going to happen here is I'm going to fall out of the sky. We're going to be on our way now, folks. We're just waiting for current clink. We can't. No man get left behind. Now, we're going to stall now. Oh, no. It's, give, it's giving us some speed. So, let's try that again. A bit safer this time. Right, up 12 feet above the surface of the ground. Okay, gear's coming up. Oh, no. Up. Props are up. Here we go. Colonel Kick, you can take off now. Okay, I shall. Let's kind of think at the beginning of the runway. Uh, over we go. Oh, we don't have. Oh, that's not green. Really yeah, that's not what I thought. I thought it would be easier to fly, you know, down the center line, but no, yeah, I think it's some practices required. If I added some power, that would help. There you go. Uh, let's turn over this way. Oh, let's flip it over and make it more easy. Up we go. Am I black out? <laughs> <laughs> I remember practicing that to fly this, you know, uh, little breathing techniques for use. So, heading at 300. And let's swing it around this way. Let's slow down. Sorry, everybody. Um, I know you're waiting for us. But we'll catch up. We'll catch up. Where's the big bunch of people now? Where's everyone? Oh. Sorry for that. Uh, right, there we go. We're on our way now, folks. Uh, let's zoom in a little bit. Yeah, that heading will do nicely. Uh, let's just catch up with everybody here. Uh, let's, I'll just add a bit of power. Uh, I'm gonna catch up with everyone. There's another one there. There's somebody, but their their um their tag isn't coming in. So that was the first incident. Yeah. Crash. So I like flying the map of the Earth. It pleases me. Uh, now I haven't looked to see how long the runways are. You know. Uh, yes. Sir. I, I don't think I don't think uh, um, D Hoover planned anything bad for us. 
I don't think so. Now, real sim gear is, is... Let's kick off real sim gear here. Uh, I haven't been on sim, I have to confess to you, folks, uh, all week. Not now. No. Um, it's like I was I was surprised today there was an update and there wasn't only an update, there was a world update. And I says, Oh, when did that happen? Yep. Okay, it's open and rescan. Hopefully we get something. I just want to use the heading bug is all really. Oh yes, the heading, the heading bug is working, folks. Uh, you're probably wondering where I'm looking. Let's clean up the screen a little bit. Go away, Rinsome Gear. Go away. Let's see my eye candy. Anything... Uh, three... Which is two three zero maybe we'll do no, we wanna go north now. Okay. Yeah, come to the first waypoint. So we're gonna take a left a right up this alley. There's someone there that is flying Mage there. What are you flying there, Mitch? The um that's a that's a detector flying there. The M339. Oh, that's a nice one. There's the group. There's the group up ahead. Full power now. I'm gonna catch up with the group. Let's fly by everybody whilst we're on the way, folks. Uh, whilst I'm on the way. So this is a reminder now of DCS World. I know I keep going on about it, but I, I was talking to DCS Ducks, and thank you very much, DCS Ducks, for your help. We're talking about servers and stuff. But first, I have to learn the uh, as much as I can about uh, my chosen aircraft, which is the... Now, you don't have to fly this aircraft, because you've got to pay for it. It's like 90 quid with the super carrier, uh, the FA-18. Uh, so I've got to learn that a little bit. So at least I can do some stuff. Uh, so I might do some videos when I get that going during the week. And we will set up, set up the server. There's Martin Biggins. There's KJLCP. Uh, so that'll be fun. Uh, we, we, we make some... Um, you know... Flight plans. And we'll have SAM sites around, you've got to fly low, and you've got to get there in a certain time or something. That'll be fun. You know. Who is this now? Captain... Captain Hook. It is Captain Hook, so Captain Hook is with us. Let's do a fly by Captain Hook here. He's in the E... Oh, 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 no crash, please, flight sir. That's Captain Hook. There he is. There is... Speaking of which, there's Hawk. That's DCS Ducks, excuse me. Oh, this Captain Hook. Oh, he's miles ahead. Let's see, let's see, he's flying something very fast. Captain Hook. I have to say, the landing in this is going to be interesting. Oh, Captain Hook, I'm going to give you an honorary flyby to welcome you to the madness. <laughs> there is CJM845. Welcome, CJ. Scream of the pilot, I like it. Uh, there's banana fish, let's go and say hello to banana fish. <laughs> oh, my flaps are up, the gear is up. Oh, my flaps are up. Oh, my flaps are up. Oh, I'm gonna go right past him now. This is the Kodiak <gasps> as well. Uh, I'd love to know when they're going to implement uh, the. the um, 
turbulence. We don't want this far to fell up here. Florida Feller uh, is the one who designed the flight plan. Isn't it, Colonel Click? Yeah, absolutely. Florida, it is Florida Feller. Hey. Okay. Florida Feller here. Okay, we got to find a e meter here. There's banana fish down there in the cardiac. Take some power off. Let's get the camera set so you can see what I'm doing. Uh, I don't know if this will work. It may do. It may well do. I don't know. Mm, no, probably not. Let's try it. I'll fiddle here now with the other computer. There we go. No, that's not going to work. There we go. You can see, at least you can see my rudder pedals on the stick movements. There you go. Right. Let's swing around. And we're turning to the south, and then that's the first runway. First runway to the south. There's everyone there. This is very interesting because everything's happening much faster than usual. Let's just see if we can make sure I'm on the right course here, folks. Yeah, I need to head south here. I haven't even heard an inkling of a stall yet. You know? Not even an inkling of a stall. It's like, Let's try. Um, try, try this, right? Try this now, right? Go somewhere uh, straight and level, right? And then just mm -hmm. push the, uh, pull the stick all the way back. Oh no. I'm very low to be doing this. Push the stick back. All the way back. Oh, it's very anti-stall. Is it? Yes. Oscillating. I'm using the rudders. Oh, there goes the wing. No, I've got it with the rudder. No, oh, that's stalling like a very nice stall. Cool. Uh, it just oscillates nose up and nose down. Okay. I'll try that again. We'll, try, we'll go power, we'll put it in a spin. I've got full power. We'll, we'll get up there somehow. Get him back on track. And hopefully I'll make it first to the runway. Look at that clear as you climb, folks. I think it's 4,000 feet, uh, feet a minute plus change in the climb. Uh, and it's stall again. Power back. Yeah, all the way back. My frame rate has been so slow since sub, says Bondosh. Sticks all the way back. Just oscillates. There goes, goes a little bit. Oh no. I don't know yeah, oh, oh, oh. Let's straighten it up here. A bit of a dive. You see the runway. It's odd. It stalls very strangely. I'm going to try it again here with no power. Let's keep it straight and level. It's maybe a little bit of nose up. Let's see take the stick back there. See the stick coming back. Very slowly. I've got no indications that my frame rates are choppy there, guys, so. so it's very. Okay, it's not as smooth as the control. I'm going to be here all day. I've got to 10 degrees. If I can see, I think that's 10. 100 knots now. Don't come on, stall, will you? There's a stall there. No, it's just I'm not going to use the ailerons. So no, my rudders seem to still the other way. All right, so it's very hard to stall. It's very hard to stall to to, to uh, you know to catch yourself out. So here's the airfield. 
I can put myself down here. Uh, I think I will have to lose a bit of speed by the time I come up here. We might do a flyover and spot the, a windsock. <clears throat> Not that it looks like there's any wind. And then we'll have a quick look at the comments and watch people coming in. Oh, it is quite short, the runway. Is there a winch or a wind sock here? I don't think so. No, there's no wind sock. So we'll take the opposite runway. Okay, gear coming down. Oh, lots of trimming needed. Lots of trimming needed. Oops, some more trimming. I don't want to run out of authority and pitch. Slow. Okay, so now I will need some flaps because this is short. Why I'm going to use full flaps? I know I'm going to have to turn all the way around. Let's, just, let's get a bit of power going. That's 100 knots now. Let's add some power. Oh, now it wants to stop. That's the speed. I have to zoom in a little bit to see the speeds. Down. There we go, there's the runway folks. Alright, coming back. 24 knots is too much. Full flaps. Trimmy, trimmy, trim, trim. Coming in over the sea, I like it. A little bit too high, but I'm happy with that. Now we're on the pappies. Let's drive it in. Oh, my recorder. Let's get the recording going. Bloody hell. No! Am I going to be too late? Can I do this and land at the same time? That's the question. Can I do both? Okay. That messed up my landing, but at least we got a recording for the replay, folks. I'm coming in for the side now. 89 knots. Oh, wants to stall, and that's what you want. You want to stall around to the runway. Oh, it's easy to land this airplane. Up we go. There we go. Nice landing. Oh, I liked always. that. There's the nose wheel. Boom. And we are. That's all the viewers stopping. Thank you, viewers. <laughs> <laughs> that is interesting. There's all man coming in the Virgo. Nice choice, all man. Love the sounds and the bumpiness of the cockpit. What they've done, you know, with with the latest update of FS Realistic, I like it. For some, Just for some it. bizarre reason, I think you landed at the wrong airport. Uh, let me double check that. Uh, it is possible. <laughs> oh, oh, that's the just for buttons. With the Xbox controller, the juicer buttons got the hang, got the Xbox controller. Producer Buttons is back, folks. Hello, say hello, Producer Buttons. Yeah, that's what happens. She, she moves her bed, and anyway. Did uh, you did, did did you overshoot the runway? No, I was taxiing to the end. Yeah, right. Uh, and Producer Buttons, it's the dog at my homework's fault. I'm gonna put my airplane I, I, over I think here. you overshot the runway. Not at all. I and, replay now. And 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 you and you are at the wrong airfield. <laughs> oh God, am I? I just saw it there and I zoomed. Uh, Hang on. <laughs> it looks like... Oh, it, what is it? Lima Sierra Zulu Lima. Yeah. You're at the wrong airfield. <laughs> so I should be at Lima Sierra Zulu Lima. Yeah. Okay. Well, I'll take off and I'll be there in a jiffy. Oops. I just saw it and said, oh, that's the one. Obviously, there's a lot of airports around here. Uh, you know. Uh, anyway... Let's get some flaps up. Old man is loyal and followed me all the way down. So is Copperhead. We don't need any flaps. Yeah, oh, Copperhead. Is, I can't see him. Full power. He's, he's, he's on approach. So I need to be going north. Dang it. Dang it all. Come on. Come on. Time to waste. There's the nose. Let's break her up. Let us go north.
Oh, I missed it entirely. Oh, yeah. That's so unlike you. <laughs> you oh, know. Equius uh, seemed to have had a slight little problem there in his Tomcat. What's that there? Equius seemed to have a slight problem <gasps> in his Tomcat there for some bizarre reason. Oh, I want to see the Tomcat. We have to buy the Tomcat to see it, don't we? Dang it all. I'm on my way. Over the Citadel Hill. Full part. Gears already up. Lots are, however, not. Lots are up here. Okay, the trimmer is very slow. I will say that. The trimmer, he needs a lot of trimming. Uh, oh, I landed. Okay, I'm going to come back to everybody. Where are you, Colonel Fink? Uh, it's like uh, I took a shortcut and I'm. Like, I took a shortcut over where you landed, which is the wrong airfield, and uh, I'm flying now to the correct airfield. Okay, go okay. uh, And people are all confused. They don't know if this. Sorry, folks, that was my... S I must have... I must have... Uh, uh, I'm very confused. So, Lima Sierra, Zulu Lima. Yeah. Okay, so... Where is it? You can't see it there. This is... <laughs> Where's everybody there? Okay. Okay, I'm gonna come in. I'm gonna come in tight. Use the speed of the turn. 300 knots. <gasps> Two. Two. You take a left base. <gasps> Two hundred knots now. Gears coming down. Flaps are coming down to full. I hope. Oh, I'm just hoping the flaps are not coming down. I have to go one at a time. Oh, I'm going to be against the sun in this one, folks. Do them one at a time, I think. There's a runway. Okay, I've gone off. Okay, that's one to be. I've got to do them one at a time. Uh, go flaps, please. Thank you. Right, coming to the right airport, and I'm 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 almost lost. Wow. Wrong airport. Everything will be fine. That's going to happen. Let's grease this one for our replay. Greaser to be quiet now and make some greaser. Two months to want to go off. Oh, we're out of 30. We're out of fish start because of the trimmer. Okay. Let's taxi back. You're on your way, Karen Click? I'm just behind you. Very good. There's someone flying over me there, and there's flying mage there going overhead. Oh dear, that was not. I landed too early. I was pulling back at the stick, and nothing happened. So the trimmer, you got to sort out the trimmer in these. You know, you've got to. Uh, I can't see which is which is neutral. Let's get the flask back up to take off. So, that was that. So now we got to the... Well, let's have a quick look at oh, those two landings we just did, okay? Before we go anywhere. Very oh. quickly, folks. Okay. Just some replays there, okay? So... There's, there's two now. Okay, there's... there's, there's Bonus landing. There's, there's, one, there's one challenge, right? You have to take off with the rest of the runway where you landed. 
Oh, I've already taxied all the way back. No, oh, no. so I have to stop and then take off in that distance. So, that's so where, where, wherever you have, wherever you stop, like you know, the remaining distance, that's where you have to take off from. Okay. Like I do the, I okay. do the same, by the way. Okay. It's like, and I'm still there where I stopped. Okay, we should do that. We right. shall do that. And if you go on the opposite of the runway, you see where I stopped. Okay. Now you can see my the other camera there, folks. Now. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Let's get my view settled here. There we go. Let's zoom in a little so bit. It's always it's always important that you have more runway in front of you than behind you. <laughs> That's right. Let's have a quick look at the replay. Okay, we'll do that. We'll do that in the rest of the show. Now, uh, replay. First landing. That was a lot of multitasking there to get that going. Oh, that's so good. We've seen that already. Let's hop outside. Ah. This was butter, I think. Not quite in the center line, though. And... Boop. Nice. That was great. Okay, so that was all right, that one. Right. Second one, however. Because I was flip-flapping around, you know. Flip laughing around. Let's pause that and go to the next landing. Which I'm convinced may have been slightly on the grass. So coming in full flaps. All nice and dandy. Over the motorway and I just very I ran out of authority, couldn't pull back any more because of the trim. And oh I broke some lights. A little bit of a bounce. Ooh, that wasn't the best. I know. Sundays are for the crazy madness. You know, they really are. Let's pause the replay. And go all the way to the end. Stop the replay. And start recording again. And we're recording again, so we don't forget. Okay, so the rule is as follows. I, I take off from where I land, okay? Yeah. Are we ready to go, folks? Absolutely. Uh, we're going to be going south now for the next runway, isn't it? Yeah. Okay, just to make sure see it here so we're off uh, I've just my flaps already yes I have oh god are you looking down when you're taking off let's go and click oh god any other wait folks excellent gears up there's cross cross welcome he's in the hunt turning south now taking a little bit of power off just a wee bit, and I haven't put anything in my keyboard for my flaps, so there we go, flaps coming up I hope, there we go, flaps are up, and we're now going south, so, oh, just this way, to go over this hill, this is like the Tom Cruise thing, okay, let's get up the hill, over the hill, Trim nose forward quite a bit with full power. 200 knots. I'm going to do the Tom Cruise trick here now. Building a bit of speed. I'm going to find the map of the earth all the way here. And this time, I'll get there before everybody else. <clears throat> This would be a butter. Okay, let's just keep on station for a moment. Oh, there we go. Oh, the back pressure. Oh. Oh. <coughs> <coughs> I'd love a G meter, there must be a G meter here somewhere. I'll have to find it. Yeah, the runway uh, could be in for a, a bit of a late. So, so the next runway is actually where the 
next runway is actually where you landed before, no? That's right, yeah. No one else has landed there yet. I won't bother recording this then, shall I? Because I just did it. No, 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 no. You have to Drop do it again. Room. You have to do it all okay. over again. Okay. Let's do it all. Oh, yes, of course, because we're doing that thing. Yeah. Okay, coming around. Short field landing. Let's get configured. 240 knots. Uh, let's just get some flaps in order. And let's get some gear in order. Uh, okay, we've got one for stage of flaps to go. Trimming nose up 150 knots. A little bit apparent just to spool the engine so we don't be happy when we need them. Guess we won't be there, but high, but who cares? Well, I care, but, you know, let's clutter up for our, our valued viewers at home. Our esteemed viewers. I want 100 knots. Let's get those flaps down. Oh, they weren't down. Great. Okay. What flaps are these? Okay, that's a bit weird. 14 knots. Okay, get on the center line. Do I have to land the piano keys? I don't care where you land. As, long, right, long, you, you know, as long as you land on the runway. <laughs> easy, easy. I land on the displaced threshold there area 100 knots all right thank you trimmy trimmy trim trim don't want to run out of 30 again 96 knots seems to handle well very slowly we'll flare over that displaced threshold oh there's lights there do oh doof right there i saw the lights at the last minute oh breaky breaky break break you know what they That's say a good landing is a landing you can walk away from I saw the lights that pulled up, we stopped. And it just thumped down. That's, that's going to be interesting. Let's see how... You fluff it up. Let's get the brakes on here. Now, what is that? Is the brake going to go all the way up? Is that fancy brakes here? Is the brakes on? Yes, good. Okay, so... Replay so. time. Oh no, hang on, let's watch everyone else. Here so comes. The colonel is coming in. <laughs> okay. Where's all the damn tags? Damn you, Microsoft fixed all the tags. Very nice, everybody. Did you all see the lights at the last minute? I thought they were high, you know, standy up your lights. Oh, they weren't. Okay. Never reacted. Oh! There's someone else at the L39C. Very nice delivery, by the way. Oh, I see what you did. Now I know what you asked. You landed on the threshold. Yeah, and it's like, yeah. Oh, the piano keys. There you are in your blue livery, isn't it? Very nice, kind of thing. Very nice, that you? Touching down? Not yet, no. I'm, I'm, Not yet. I'm, that was... Okay. So I do the same. banana fish. I do the same as you did. That okay. is like cheating, what you so. I thumped it down though. Yeah, but you landed on the piano key, not on the piano keys. You landed the, way the, before the piano keys. Yes, that's correct. Yeah, no, it's the threshold is like out of order. Are you coming in now over there? Oh, there you are. I see you now. They, they, they came in right. right. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Oh, Davo, Davo, under the lights as well. Colonel Click is gonna hit the lights. Is he gonna hit the lights? Colonel Click hit the lights. I let you wait. Oh, 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 oh. Very nice, Colonel Clink. Very nice. Oh, zoom. I like that. Very nice. What's coming in now? Raptor X. In the Kodiak. Very nice, Raptor X. Very nice. Uh, Johnny F. Followed by Marvin Biggins and Baker Flies coming in. So and Johnny F's in the, uh, in the jet as well. We're coming in one by one nine. I know a lot of you down the other end. Let's go down the other end. We're leaving people out. So Captain Hook uh, landed there. So it's, it's like for the next for the next airfield, right? Okay, it's it's like okay. piano keys, like and where you stop, not the okay. threshold. That is out of order. I know. I, you know, <laughs> I'd rather uh, you know in this way. Let's see that awful landing I did. Okay, uh, that was quite that was quite bad. Right, because again, I ran out of. Rudder authority. 
I ran out of a tarte. And uh, it just plonked it down. The trim is very slow. It takes ages to trim up and, you know, tri trim down. So here we go. I don't know if I can see the ailerons move slightly. Now, I know. I know what you're going to say. Boom! Oh, nasty. I live in shame. I would live in shame. Oh, you had everything. Landing uh, on a nose wheel and tail strike. That was awful. <laughs> yeah. Oh, no, 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 stop replay. Have I done it? No, of course. Yes. Okay, recording. Now, what time is it? Uh, 15 minutes in. Uh, okay. So, oh, the camera's moved with all the excitement. You can't see the stick is under here, folks. Look. There's a stick there. I must have hit it with my elbow. Um, now. Are we ready to go, Colonel Clay? Can everybody? Oh uh, yeah, I would say so. Okay, I'll leave it at 10 flaps. Let's go, full part. Okay, let's do that in and then. Uh, get rid of the brakes. for this one. Lots of trimming. Zoom in on the fish. Boom. To the valleys. Uh, this would be interesting. Now, I wonder if I can see if I get a, a, G, a G meter. I'm still trimming forward now, folks, as we speak. No, I know the trimming to do. No. No, 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 no. Now, there we go. That's reasonably good. Uh, is there a G meter? Be a gene. Oh, look at the detail. Wow. With the rudder pedals there. Look at that. That's very nice. I can't put my eyes in a G meter. Uh, um, which is unfortunate. Oh, 150 kilograms fuel. So I've gone through quite a lot of fuel. So we pop the old fuel up there, will we? Rid of the payload. Let's fly the map of the earth then until we get there. Let's add a bit of power. So at least I'll be there before everybody else this time. All manual flying. No straight and level flight here, folks. No, uh, no cruise really to speak of, except the madness. Now, where is the next runway? Gonna be quite a bit away, actually. It's very awkward to do this in fly. So, just have to fly the map of the Earth for a while. Zoom out a little bit so you can see the cockpit with the mouse. <coughs> uh, I'm not going down that way. Let's jam the part throttles fully forward. Uh, let's try a roll. Now, typically when I did this, a roll in this, obviously we're higher 
You put the nose up, you, you accelerate it. Put the nose down, I'm, I'm not quite, well, you did this. Put the nose down a bit. And then you put the nose up a bit to accelerate. Can't remember the speed, so there we go. I'm just. <coughs> Easy. Um, you should. You shouldn't put negative pressure. What I used to do when I was a kid playing simulators is, I go upside down. Right, just, I'm doing the slower, and then I apply forward pressure on the stick, and then back pressure. So it effectively wouldn't. The nose wouldn't go down, and that's a very bad habit because you have negative G and you don't negative G. If you push forward, uh, red out, you're gone. <coughs> Apparently. I only did it for a day. So, I'm not an expert. Uh, we're on track. We're on track. Oh, so, yeah. Some Tom Cruise flying there, folks. Will I get away with it? I'm going out to this valley. Nope. Let's have some of the comments. I'm sure I'm not missing an airport. I better make sure that I'm not missing an airport. Now, why is that doing that? I want... Oh, right, on the airport, please. On the airport, thank you. There we go. Is that an airport in there? Let's uh, get some eye candy at the outside the aircraft, folks. Sorry, I haven't done that for ages. I'm too busy flying. So I'll disable the cameras for the moment. And we've got to get some eye candy in here. Uh, boom. And boom. Oh, no, no, no. There we go. Now we're clear. Yeah. Okay. I would say you can. I shall do this song. Okay. So, that set set. Uh, old particle. So, yeah, let me just get this thing straight. Oh, it's one way. We've got a landing coming up, so. Uh, activate the screen. There we go. I like delivery. Tumbling goose. Uh, it's not very good in a in a in a Kodiak. <laughs> no. It 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 rolls very slowly. Where's that one? Oh, the one we stayed ahead. I see the runway. Camera's back on. Well, what is the next uh, uh, airfield? Uh, I think... Oh, hang on. Hang on. And Lucho. We've gone over the damn thing. Lima, India, Lima, Vic, uh, Victor. We've gone over the damn thing. Well, <gasps> it's... Looks like it. I could be wrong. I'm going in anyway. Over here somewhere. Let's keep it up. Let me. Let me have a look here on the. Um, so that's a that's a way point. Oh, I see it. I think, but it's, it's just off the line, so. <coughs> it's quite short. Hmm. I think that's it. If it is one. I don't. I don't know. It's. I don't know either. 
It's like off the line. I don't know if it's actually going through it. I, I don't know. I think it's like the, there's no more airfield to land there until the final airfield. Jacob, A45, thank you. Is that really? Well, we put it down here anyway. I don't know. Okay, so we're going to go, folks, to... It's right off the, uh, the magenta line there. Uh, it is... I can't zoom in, computer. I want to zoom in. What is going on with my mouse? Lima, India, Lima, Victor. Lima, That's India, it. Lima, Victor? I know, it didn't pop up for ages. <laughs> Obviously, we're not going there. Oh, like I see, I see where this... Uh, let's land there anyway, just for good measure, and then we can take a break. Just for shits and giggles? Yeah. Okay, folks. So it's Lima, Lima, India, Lima, Victor. That's it. Yeah, happy days. Okay. I will do a right-hand orbit, drop the gear. Oops. Get the flaps coming down. Take a right-hand turn. Yeah, everything's fine here. I'm doing a nice approach. How are you getting on there, Colonel Kick? Oh, not too bad. Okay. So it's like, um, you land in a sitting room or something like that. It's all fine. <laughs> everything's fine. Nothing, nothing bad's happening. Oh, 170 knots is not going to happen. Went too slow and I stalled, I have to be honest. And too slow. Put all those flaps down. Just, you see it? Mm. Okay. So the gear's gone up. And that looked very nice to me. No, no, no. Uh, please. See, I've got to look. You don't want to be looking at switches and stuff. That's nope. what happened to me. Look at my 112 knots already. Those full flaps. That's a power now, I'm increasing speed, I'll be alright. Let's keep losing altitude, so that should be fine. Now we're trapped. There we are. Stop on the piano keys, folks, and I can take off from there. Uh, otherwise, it's a fail, okay? So I have to stop. In other words, where I stop, I have to take off from. Don't stall on me. Getting very pitchy in the nose. Oh, God, come on. Get the thin runway. I'm going to pop it down. Ryanair landing. Oh. What a nice touchdown. So I have got to take off from here, folks. Breaks on. I don't know what they're clapping about. I don't know what they're clapping about. We'll have a look at the replay. Oh, actually, let's watch everybody else. That's what I said I'd do. Let's do that. And then we'll do the replay. So, who we got? We have... Someone's coming in, obviously, on the... I have to buy that airplane. This, because you can't see it. It's a VTOL aircraft. Uh, oh, is everyone down already? No, he goes flying Mitch now here. Where are you in that current clink? Have you landed? I can't see a current clink. Did you made it down? 
Oh, uh, Flying Mage is in the MiG-29. Interesting. I wonder what that will show up as. There's an FA. There's Tango 2-2. Two, uh, Tango two two. In the Hornet as well. That's the Hornet. The MiG-29 is uh, 600 meters away. I don't think that's going to show up as a MiG-29 because I don't have it in my collection. Here comes a few here. Here comes uh, Captain Hook. Oh, breaky, 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 break, break, Captain Hook. He made it. Uh, we have Mar Mazak. Oh, going around. Very clever. Very clever. There's Baker Fly. Here comes Slurpy Jam and Big Smashy Smash Smash. Cross made it. Oh! In cars coming in the PC6. Very nice. Uh, I can't see Colonel Clink. Colonel Clink, have you gone? Colonel Clink? No? I'm, Colonel Clink? I'm, I'm here. I'm here. I'm just doing a different approach. Oh, I just couldn't see your tag and I couldn't hear you. Sorry. Oh yeah, I'm, I'm I'm coming. I'm coming from a different side, like you know, like everybody else. Like you know. After X, very nice for After X and the C two O eight. Easy for After X. It's easy for After X. There goes EMU. A B uh, Mike uniform. Bravo Mike uniform. Pickups no, not a lot. Very nice. Uh, Mazak is coming in, Florida Fella is coming in, and Sling. Florida Fella is cleverly flying the Beechcraft 58. Uh, so for the moment, it looks like Raptor X is the shortest landing. I guess Florida Fella, and very nice. Uh, he chose the grass. Runway. Here comes Sling. In the Kodiak. Can he stop Ernie is the thing. Very nice. I can't see Colonel Clink yet. What, what, what heading are you taking? The uh, road I'm, I'm on base. Zero, uh, two zero? I'm on right base, yeah. So I'm coming in after that was somewhere. Okay. You'll pop up. There comes Banana Fish 4. Very nice Banana Fish. Right down early, look. Let's reverse thrust on. Uh, Mazik is flying around in the, uh, the L39DB. There's Davo coming down, C20310. Very nice. I was getting very confused with the fuel tax of that the other week. I fixed that problem though. Uh, can't see Colonel Clink there, folks. Uh, Colonel Clink is on final now. You don't have much luck coming into the old tax there. See, it only, it only lets 20 in at a time, and I don't know how it organizes. We're going to miss Colonel Clink's landing. You're never nowhere to be seen. Maybe you'll pop in at the last minute. Nope. We've got Mazak. I'm behind Mazak. Oh, good. Because Mazak and the L39. Oh, this looks good. Oh, did the same as me. A bit better than me, though. Mazak. Right Here comes Colonel Clink now. We are watching Colonel Clink now coming in. Uh, a relatively old hat and landed very early. And he has stopped incredibly early to Colonel Clink. Two poids to Colonel Clink. Two poids. There we are. Ten poids. Easy. And Baker Fly. And applause. This is fantastic. Clappity clap clap clap. Oh yeah. So, we're going to take a break, you said? Yeah, I think we okay. take a break and then we yeah. do the rest of the flight, I would say. We will. We will. Yeah. Because uh, i got to water the horses. Absolutely. Yeah. So, we'll take a break, folks. It's, about, it's, it's five minutes. Exactly. So, i got to run. i got to put this out of the way here so I can go very quickly. Uh, and we'll be back in exactly... Uh, five minutes. Get yourself a cup of tea, a snack, you know, a uh, Kit Kat or something, or a Snickers, and all that kind of stuff. We'll see you in exactly five minutes. See you. 
And now, let's enjoy an intermission. We hope you filled your snack bar full of tasty treats to eat and drink. Perhaps a tempty tasting hotting dog, or a thirst quenching sugar drink. Some fresh crunching popping corn, perhaps, or an assortment of sugar coated sweetness, even enjoying a sickness stick. We've plenty of time, so visit your snack bar now. See now, Mr. and Mrs. Barker enjoying and gorging on the lovely treats with their lovely children. You could be doing this too, you still have time. And for those of you tea lovers, let's have a look at some tea making tips. Yes, the most important tea making tip, of course, when you have time, is to use the right mug. Yes, the right tea mug is always the right way. Look for the Gripersim tea mug. Yes, it makes your tea taste 20% better. No, don't worry, you still have plenty of time to make your cup of tea. Mrs. Ainsley Cretra, what do you think of drinking a cup of tea from the Gripersim mug as opposed to the normal mug? Lovely. It's not everyone who can make a good cup of tea. Splendid, Mrs. Ainsley Crabtree. Now, here are the ladies discussing the six points of making a good cup of tea, and of course, the Gripsin mug will be included. Which number will it be? Can I remember them? Of course you can. Try now. All right, here goes. Number one. Mama, see the Gripsin mug? Always use a good quality tea. Oh, yes, of course. Good. Number two. Always use freshly drawn water, right? Um, number, number three. three, remember to warm the teapot or urn. Everyone knows that one. And number four, measure the right quantity of tea Butter. for the amount of water in the pot. Very good. Number five, the water must reach boiling point, pot to the kettle, not kettle to the pot. And the last rule, number six. Here we go. Let the tea brew for five to ten Damn minutes. Damn your eyes, right, woman! God bless. <laughs> Where does it all start? Sometimes here, with an acid stomach, or here, with tense, upset digestive nerves. It may even reach here, with that fuzzy, achy feeling in the head. Are you suffering from intermission anxiety? It's the acid tension trouble triangle you're suffering from. Yes, now there's a new anti-intermission liquid, Peptis Liquid Elixir. It will break that bothersome intermission trouble triangle. This fast-acting liquid has no need to wait for it to dissolve as it's in liquid form. With unknown ingredients, it will settle acid in your stomach and those nasty intermission blues. Side effect of peptides may include constipation, skin rash or dermatitis, diarrhea, dizziness, drowsiness, dry mouth, severe migraines, insomnia, suicidal thoughts, abnormal heart rhythms, internal bleeding, cancer, loss of sexual appendages, funny walk syndrome, loss of hair, reddening of the hair, big red nose syndrome, whitening of the skin, unusual voice patterns, childish behaviours, a propensity to blow up balloons. Death. Break that intermission trouble triangle with Peptas. Yes, Peptas available somewhere. Just a minute, folks. Yes, that's all it takes to visit our refreshment counter in the lobby. There you'll find popcorn and an assortment of popular candy bars to please every taste. Try one of these delicious candy bars. Big time. Ingredients include chemicals derived from petroleum. Butternut. Preservatives including sodium benzoate and sulfur dioxide. No nuts included. Milkshake. Including wood pulp and duck feathers as fillers. Payday. Including propylene glycol, carcinogenic flavorings, including trace elements of starch, strychnine, and Topped lead. Topped with Hollywood's super rich coating of the kind you like best. They taste wonderful. They're delicious. They're nutritious. Get one at our confection counter in the lobby now. now. word from our esteemed producer. 
such kind words. And now back to our normally scheduled programming. <clears throat> so, you know, uh, I know <clears throat> we, we landed on the wrong airport, okay? But if you make a mistake, right, and someone says, points out the mistake, what you do in Ireland is you look them dead in the eye and you go, so what? So what? There's a technique to it. You've got to leave your mouth open. So what? <laughs> that's, you know, that's what I do. Huh? At your point. So what? So what? I don't have to have a point. I can do what I like. Here's another one for you. Right. So. I could so do I just, what I like. I, I just take off now, like, you know. That's like too much chit chat chatter here. Now, I'm going to do the replay. Oh, you're doing the replay? Okay. Do the Let's replay. have a look I'm at the replay. I'm going to do that, yeah. that crazy take off because I haven't got a lot of room to, do the to, you know, to take off. Yeah. Uh, let's get the replay going, folks. All right. So, let's uh, stop recording and replay and zoom to the end. You know, pause replay and zoom all the way down to here. So, come here. Do, do you have an afterburner? No. No. That's what I know of now. I don't think they have afterburners. But military trainers, they're not overly uh, sophisticated aircraft. Yeah. They're military trainers, you know. Ah, well. <gasps> Joe! Bless you. That was a big one. Yeah. Cool I should have got a cheer for that. <laughs> cheer. Oh, look, people are subscribing and everything after that sneeze. <laughs> that will be uh, a famous thing. Resume replay. Let's go and have a look at this. Uh, let's see how this went. So I'm oh, yeah. side. Come on. Show us. Let's see how this went. Oh, that was a tough sneeze. Got a headache now. So, is it tough one? I wanted firm. Yeah, that's firm enough. And jamming, jamming on the brakes. Took a while to stop there, folks, didn't it? You know? Took a while to stop. But we got in. I didn't want a uh, floaty, floaty landing. Most certainly not. I kick off the recording again, and we're recording. And now I've got to get off the runway in this space. So, as you can yeah. see here ahead of me, there's uh, a windmill. Right. Okay. So I can fly in between the blades. I see a UFO floating around. Uh, I know that is a VTOL aircraft and I haven't purchased it or haven't installed it and we're not getting the livery. So, uh, flaps wise, I think I'll use uh, takeoff flaps. I we'll have full power. Sorry, go, go ahead, Colonel Craig. I think you want 20 flaps. No, that's too. No. Oh, well. No, let's see how it goes. Okay. Be wrong. Yeah. Feet on the brakes, full power. Let's boot up. And let's hope for the best. Off we go. Forward on the stick. So everything is forward. Turbine is burning. 60 knots. 80 knots. And up we go. Oh, did it quite easily. That was easy. That was easy, folks. Wasn't it? Gears coming up. So. Uh, the actual... So now here's a here's a question for you, right? Would there be some genius, right? Actually plonking a wind turbine at the end of the runway. I didn't see anyone there. Yeah no, but it's like just, you know, stupid, no? I hope it's not there in real life. Oh, that was me, you mean? No, the wind turbine. Uh God knows. I would say it's not. I would say that. But trim a really quite a significant amount. Now, this is the airport. I think the next waypoint is the airport, isn't it? Um, Let's see. I'm looking from... You see, It's just a waypoint. Okay, I'm looking quite far away. So, I'm, I'm kind of... I just saw it there. And I'm, I didn't want to make a mistake. So, uh, it looks like it is... Oh, we've got a good bit to go. Uh, no, okay. See, that's the mistake I made. Look, there's one called Lima, India... A Yankee Tango there, you know, I could easily make that mistake when we're looking from far away. We've got a lot. This is the last airport, isn't no, it? No, no, no. We just fly by that thing. 
Yeah, but the last airport is Lima India Papa X-Ray. Yeah, something like that, yeah. And that's where we're going, folks. So it's it's all plain sailing now. It's all plain sailing, folks. Uh, if we if we finish this early, we might do Saba. What say you? Ah, uh, sure, why not? So, there so we go. Okay, so be going into cruise mode and. So now, uh, we will do some crazy stuff. Let's see if you can see the controls there. You can. That will do. And you can see the stick of the throttle. Great. Uh, lip the lip. Let's get the speed up. Heading at least somehow right where we're going. There we go, we're gonna go into that valley later. So loop to loop, you lower the nose until you get a certain speed, can't remember what it is. And up we go. a bit of road. I'm sure we're going fast enough for that. There we go. And why not another loop the loop? I dare say, on the way. Okay, that's a bit extreme. That's... You have the energy left. Let's see what happens if you stall at the top. It appears we do. Oh, just barely. There we go. Now, who's this down below? Let's clutter up. Activate the screen. Oh. I see someone I'm coming in for the attack run. Coming in. That looks like someone in a jet. Let's see if I can keep behind this guy. That's all man in the Virgo. Oh, I, I don't think we'll be doing dark fighting with him. Just fly right by. <gasps> we get someone. Uh, there's, there's Copper Hash in a TVM. Or TV. Oh, there's the top cash. Okay. So, windage, you're under pressure, because I'm going to get in behind you and see how long I keep you uh, behind me. Would you like them apples? <gasps> he goes faster than me, so it's going to be tricky. No, he's, he's flying along. Windage, I'll never catch him. I'll never catch him. Uh, can I? Can I keep him? He's obviously flying along. Is he? Uh, anyone find slower Josh? 
What's the D-77? Yeah, Windich is gone. He's, he's gone. Uh, oh, there's 2-3 Sierra in the L-39 as well. That's an even match. 2-3 so Sierra, I'm going to keep it in my... In my... 2-3 Sierra. We've got a... You know, I don't know if he's watching as well. But we'll just see if he, if he, if he sees that uh, I'm behind him. Lots of trimming required here. Oh, I think he's copped it. I think he's copped it. Yeah, he's merging now. Yeah, he's he he knows. He knows. Go up. Two to share. There he is. Behind him. And let's see if I can, if I can keep. Oh, he's putting on the brakes. He's going Let's put the gear down. To slow down. Let's put the gear down. I think. There he is. There he is. He's climbing up. He's going to run out of energy now. Still behind him. Still behind him. He's diving, he's trying to get away from me. I'm gonna stay high, because I need the energy. He's gonna lose a lot of energy now, he's gonna to have to come up from there, but I'm still behind him. And if I want, I can get lock on him anytime I want it. You know? Okay, we call that. I'm getting carried away here, Colonel Click. Right, back to... <laughs> yeah. I'm not saying anything. Back to the... Uh, oh, he's trying to get away from me again. Oh, he's doing some very fancy manoeuvres. Oh, he slowed right down there. <laughs> Okay, let's continue on the flight plan. I got gotcha. you. Okay, uh, let's see if we can fly the rest of this right uh, very low and very fast. Flaps up. Yes, I do. Well, I may as well settle in. Put the seat back a little bit. the earth. Not going as fast as I'd like. Uh, 387 knots. Ground speed is 391 knots. This is fast. We're going to get him, I'm afraid, folks. There's DCS Ducks and the Hawk. Okay, DCS Ducks at the top. I'm going to try and keep you in my uh, windshield, if you're, if you're watching the video as well. We should really merge and all kind of crack, but to make it fair. But let's see. I think DCS Ducks is a bit more experienced in this kind of thing than I am. In all fairness. So DCS Ducks, my mission is to keep you uh, on my nose. Oh, I'm going to keep the power on. I'm 
Okay, I don't think you can hear me. I think he's watching the stream as well. Where is he? I don't know. Lots of energy. Seat is in my way. <laughs> He's behind you. Yeah, because the seat is in my way. I'm like, oh, why is it? It's the graphics. Come on, I'm easy. Yeah. You have to look like the view, or you can look right behind you. Oh, oh he crashed. DC trucks crashed to the hill. Oh, dear. Oh, okay, DC trucks are coming again. You can ahead of me. He's falling ahead of me, or I'm merging all that kind of crack. Crack, uh, it's even so far for Eva 5, Windage, Nighthawk, Father Ted, Ullman, uh, Mazak 234, all ahead. Climb. No, no. no. Can't really look behind me, kind of. Seats blocking my vision. There's cross in the hunt. What is the hunt? Hunt a hog. Is he gonna survive trying to get back to my me? <laughs> <laughs> Oh, there's these sisters there now. He's taking off again. Oh, okay, we're back in with these sisters. He's trying to get me to crash. Ha <laughs> ha! <laughs> yeah, he's definitely trying to get me to crash. There's Cross there joining in. Oh, I lost him. There he is. We stalled. It's gone upside down, and weird things are happening. Yeah. <laughs> We're looting around here. We're not doing our right at all. Into the mountains, there, folks. Now, this is interesting. This valley looks very interesting indeed. Let's go into this valley. 
that looks like it's kind of following our course. If I get through this without crashing now, I'd be I'd be pleased. Let's get this dead ahead. There's Father Ted, there's uh, Nighthawk, Evil Five, and Mazak. So let's get deeper into this valley here now. This is interesting. This is all very interesting. Perfect. You should have joined me in the uh, in the L39. You've gone very quiet. I can't think. I says I have a plan. I do have a plan. A challenge? Yeah. Okay. Not today, though. Not today. You look out. Okay. okay. Whoa! Hey! I have to decide. I have to decide on the correct airplane for that. You have which? I have to decide on the correct airplane for that. Oh, okay. Yeah. Uh, my police instructs is ahead of me again. So we're coming for our last runway, and the same thing still applies with regards to the landings. Absolutely. The boys are really flying ahead. Am I doing something wrong here? Drops are up here, it's up. Let's find Mitch in the M339. Let's see if I can catch up with some of the boys. down this large lake. This is a massive lake. Yeah. Now, one thing I want to try is do we get the wake of the water? So we'll be careful here now because this lake is like glass. Let's get down lower. See. Let's see if I come outside. Let's see if I adjust the camera. I don't think it has the wake. And press the C button. Let's see if we can actually. Oh, I'm losing every percent. Doesn't look like it. Like glass. I'm hoping to see a shadow here. I could very well crash, crash into. <coughs> yeah, there's no wake. <coughs> no. Oh, well. oh. No, it doesn't look like it does splashes either. No. <laughs> uh, no, it does not. This flying mage and the bird goes quite quick, doesn't it? If I remember correctly. Yeah. I was thinking of a different airplane. This yes, stuff is flying ahead. Are you with the group there at the end, Colonel Clink? With all the props? 
Um, I'm here um, somewhere with Florida fella and whatnot. Oh, I see you all now, yeah. I see you all now, yeah. Let's see if we can get back to fly in the... Keep him in my windshield here. You wouldn't think the lake is so big. It's absolutely massive. You may as well be beside the sea. You know, in Europe. Yeah. There's flying mage in front of me. Very nice. Now we're getting over land again. Oh, I try a bit of talk about the GCS talks here if he's, if he's listening. Oh, it's a merge. <sighs> okay, so we're, we're, we're square. <gasps> Behind me. Yeah. 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 Put him there. There he is. Right, I am joining behind TCS Ducks. Let's see how long I can stay behind him. The lights actually are killing my eyes. The key lights. Okay, just to see stuck, let's see if we can just stay behind him now. I really don't know which is a better aircraft from maneuvering, I have no idea. But I think he's he's getting away from me here. I can't seem to keep up with him. Let's try the map of the earth anyway. We're going low. Oh, there goes Becker Fly and the Hawk. Oh, the Hawk's much faster than me. By far. It looks like. Coming around to the final airport. Oh, 
Oh, do a bit of fly by, fly by down by the runway. Hopefully, if I can get it lined up. There we go. Oh, oh, easy now, good percent. Don't crash into the ground. There we go. Get on the central line. Now, let's see if I can do something fancy here. I'm going to try something crazy. I'm going to do loop the loop and then come in and land from the other side of the loop. Up we go. Should just turn and come into land, so I gotta control my speed. So whilst I'm upside down, I'm gonna have a good replay. Uh, whilst I'm gonna have a good replay. Here coming down or up. Here's going up. Here's going up. Thank you very much uh, for that transponder sim, was it? The transport simmer. Thank you very much for following. We're doing some crazy stuff here, as we always do on Sundays. And it's shocking. It's very bold. I'm going to lower flaps down in the middle of a dive. Come in. Where's my way? There. Oh, we're actually a bit short. I think I have to slow down a little bit. Now, this isn't going to work, is it? It's just not going to work, because I'm going to be going way too fast to come in and land now. Way, way, way too fast. Like 250 knots? I don't think so. I could do a bit of, you know. This business. Oh, out of control! I wonder what that looks like from the outside. I got a clap, but I'm still in the air. <laughs> What's that brake turbulence? I don't know. <laughs> oh, I'll go around. I'm running out of the way. Let's do this properly. Let's do a nice landing. This one. Flaps. there. I'd like to see that loop the loop thing, though. You know, I really would. Can it be done, folks? That's the question. That's the one we're now. Anyway, up we go. Okay, so if I stay here, I come down. Here it's going up. They're going up, folks. Let's lose a bit of altitude here. There comes in car. There's Colonel Fink now. Oh no, that's Captain Hook. Excuse me. Try to read upside down. Slow down quite considerably. Checking all the power off. I practically want to stall now. On the way in. Oh, oh no, I don't want to turn over the right way. Okay, let's come up and down this way. Gain too much speed again. I think I'm at 200 knots already. There's no way that's going to happen. That's a nice turn on the way in. This looks like it's a military airfield as well, which is quite ironic. I 
let's pop it down in here. Need to do a lot of climbing nose up. Let's get on the centre line here. Very messy on the stick. Stop that. Come on. Let's tell you. Nice. Nice butter landing. Very pitchy. There we go. Bit of braking. Let's taxi back. Oh, I got a bing bing, and that was K333GZ uh, is now following. Uh, K333, thank you very much. So that was some madness. I think the jets are kind of popular, folks. It seems to me. Let's declutter. Let's find a parking space. How are you getting on, Colonel Clink? airport now. Oh, is that an exit there? We'll take that. We'll take that. I saw a lot of military hangars there. That's very ironic. Isn't it? So we're going to have a look at those. See if we can make our way to them. At the back here, somewhere, if I remember. Or are they over there? Let's go past the uh, airplane anyway. Is this one of those Microsoft? Is this a built? I don't know. Or is this Autogen? It looks kind of. I've got to get a monitor with a better refresh rate. It's wrecking my eyes. I know it looks smooth to you. I hope God it looks smooth to you on, on YouTube and Twitch. But the monitor is quite twitchy. And it's... Not... It's a television, actually. Um, I got some years ago. And I think it's bad for my eyes, folks. I think it's madness, the refresh rate. Uh, and it's... It's possibly spoiling my enjoyment of flights today. But is it just the tracker, maybe? I don't know. It's like, I, I think don't the refresh know rate is terrible. I don't know if there's any difference between when I have the tracker on or off. Yeah, it's just, it's actually the refresh rate. It's, it's, it's bugging out on me and stuff, so not a bummer. Uh, they say a monitor is best to get a monitor, but you can't get a big monitor. Do you know? Well, define big. Well, this is about 45 inch screen, 48 or 40 something, 42 inches, I think. So I have a 42 inch ultra wide. I know, but it doesn't have the d the. Oh, okay. Well. Hmm. Yeah. Ultra wide. Yeah. Yeah, I don't know. I like the height as well. But maybe I should come and see it. I don't know. I'll have to have a look at one. Oh, a friend of mine has one as well up the road here. So this is definitely... This looks to me like military. These little patterns here. So we park at the centre of the circle. There's someone behind me there. Who's that? Duty Sierra! So, I will get out of Duty Sierra's way. We'll park up here. That was a little bit more enjoyable, oddly enough, because I was cooring around. You know, uh, I, 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 I crashed twice. I know. Was it only twice? Or was it three times? I don't know. I told there was more. <laughs> Maybe. Maybe. There we go. Nice and... And I, I was so busy I didn't even get a chance to read the comments at all. So it wasn't a cruisy flight. It kept me quite busy all the way through. Do you know? 
Because sometimes <coughs> you're sitting at the cruise and you're going, right, uh, what am I doing next? I'll read the comments. So let's have a look at the comments here now. Uh, I'll go from the bottom up. Uh, how many, Mr. Griffin? Oh, yeah, it was two or three. Uh, what track IO do, do I have? Says the editor. The track IO is called the Toby. T O B I I. T O B I I. And you don't need a little hat or anything like that. It's good for maybe uh, 180 degrees, but beyond that, as you can see, I couldn't look behind me and stuff. Really, mind you, the yeah, seat of the aircraft was in my way, but I'm happy with it. It is. It is like when you when you're in front of the main screen and you can turn your head about. Uh, what is it? 45 degrees either side. Yeah. So roughly. Uh, yeah, about 100 degrees. So it's good for that. Uh, the audio effects volume is way higher than your own voice, says uh, Epaulette. Oh, really? Okay, thank you, Epaulette. Because that is something we don't want. So, uh, is that when I'm outside the aircraft, I'm wondering? I'll have to review the video. I'll relook at the video, and I'll sort that out. Uh, okay, because that you might be making sense there, I think. Uh, why isn't FS Realistic coming up? Where's the window? Anyway, I'll have to worry about that later. Thank you. There it is. So, yeah, you can be right. I'll have to change each individual one. Look. Do you know? So, I'll review that. Thank you very much. Uh, da, da, da. Oh, Wendy just saying, sorry, Gripper Simpsons. There's a bit of a delay between me and the stream. Of course there is. That's stupid of me. I was saying, okay, I'm, I'm coming in behind you, but there's a delay in what I say, isn't there? Uh, maybe we should have landed at level. Oh, yeah, that's not the wrong one, right? <coughs> yeah, yeah. Uh, Nighthawk, post a few pictures on the Discord. Brilliant. Um, Reduce her buttons was fast asleep, thankfully, so she didn't see me going to the wrong airport. Uh, and we're talking about the flight plan. That was on YouTube and on Twitch there. Uh, DCS Strucks was saying I see that I couldn't even glance uh, and I didn't do my landing thing either I'm probably quite tired today I think that's probably why I keep forgetting these um, my eyes are actually burning you know uh, doesn't OLED have a good refresh rate Davos says I don't know I'll have to look into it but I don't want to buy a new TV I can't do it, do it. I can't do another TV at the minute I'll just have to live with it it's not, it's not as if it's really a first world problem, isn't it? Oh, my refresh rate on my monitor! <laughs> oh my god, I'm so uh, disadvantaged! You know, so... <laughs> it's a good problem to have. Uh, in all fairness. But, you know, you know how it goes with your hobbies and whatnot. It could be, you know, some people going, Oh, my, my wood wedge, or whatever golf course it's called. I have to get a new wedge. So, Colonel Clink, have you come in and landed yet? Uh, I'm, I'm just on... Uh, on final here, I'm... Oh, it has a thingy bob. What has a thingy bob? It has an approach thingy. Let's see I, if, if... What is called an ILS, perhaps? Yeah. Let's see if oh, it you're does you're miles it. away, are you? Let's get it some time. It goes here. approach and everything. Hang on a second here. So, we'll... we'll, we'll I think we call that... we we'll wait for current clink. we call that... I'll just spot around and see what people are flying here and try and activate. Uh, That's pretty much the end of the flying part of the sim, I think, Colonel Clink, isn't it? Yeah. Okay, uh, I just switched the old I'm looking at Slurpy Jam, and I'm looking at... That is a Slurpy Jam. I can't get their tag. Slurpy Jam is in the, the Hunter. Now, what's the Hunter? Can I get that in the store? It's a, Well, it's the... There's, there's two versions of the Hawk. It's the Hawk and the Hunter the Hunt. Hawk. It's the Hunt. So I can see like big jets, but I know they're flying something and they're flying in, in very, very well together. It's cross. They're flying very well together and I want to get that aircraft so I can see this in the future, you know. Um, you know, which is a shame, Microsoft. Shame on you. We can't see it currently. So thank you guys. Thank you to Cross and Slurpy Jab. Those of you who followed. Uh, who followed it this week? Uh, let me just read it out there again. We had uh, Halrock, K33GZ, uh, the Transport Simmer, and Jacob. Uh, thank you very much, guys. There's Johnny F off on the hook. 
Thank you, Johnny F. There's DCS Ducks and the Hawk as well. Uh, we have Pitches buttons is getting fed up. <laughs> Let's get Pitches buttons in the camera so you can say goodbye. We're just waiting for Colonel Clink. It only be it's only manners, isn't it? Uh, CJM, welcome by the way. CJM845, Captain Hook, welcome. Banana Fish, Bakerfly, Davos with us, Nighthawk, Evil 5, Shady Sim, Raptor X, Johnny F73. Ah, there's Johnny F73. I was wondering where Johnny F73 has gone. Uh, Sling380, Florida Fella, who designed the flight plan. Florida Fella, thank you very much. 23 Sierra, Windage, In Car, All Man, Father Ted, Cop Copper Hat, and Trip 500. Uh, and there's ARH64 CDN. KJLCP, no, not a lot. And I think I've mentioned almost everybody. But that's not everyone who's flying along with us because we can't see the, you know, we can't see more than ours. So 25. So there's Cross and Slurpee Jam. Right, let's just keep up with them for a little bit, right? There's Colonel King coming into his landing. Uh, I'm going to come up to those guys now again and see how well they're doing because they're doing really good synchronized flying, you know. Here comes Colonel Clink. Colonel Clink is coming in over the lights with Stem Stemmen. Colonel Clink and Stemmen, and Colonel Clink is flying very, very slowly and boop. Oh, it's very short landing. Very nice, Colonel Clink. I think you, you may have done the shortest landing of the day. Well, how do you like them apples? Those apples are good. They're agreeable. <laughs> They're agreeable apples. This Equinus Savalt coming in at the top. Gosh, oh, we forgot to say look to Equinus Savalt. Go on, fly by Equinus. We're going to be right here in the camera. Oh, I can't see the Tomcat. He's flying. What a pity. <laughs> I can't see the time cash. Microsoft, get your liveries in order. So, folks, thank you very much for joining us. I know we're a little bit early, about two hours into it. Oh, yeah. Uh, you know, I'm I'm doing the DCS world stuff. I'll, if When I get to it, I'll stream it in the week, during the week. It just happened. I'm sorry, I can't just yet schedule it. But you can watch the recording. So I'm going to play with some of that. Uh, I, I need to know what I'm doing to some degree with DCS world. Uh, and, and, you know, we'll be on next Sunday as always at 2100 hours on the North European server. So, Curtin Clink? Yeah. Thank you very much for once again joining us. Absolutely. And thanks to everybody. Thanks uh, for the Hoover for the flight plan. Uh, it was fantastic. Yes, De Hoover. Thank you very much. No, are you sure it was De Hoover? Yeah, De Hoover and uh, Florian Fellow is the same guy. Oh, it is the same guy. Okay, I was getting, yeah. yeah. Everyone has different call signs. I know. It's very confusing. So, guys, uh, have a great uh, summer. Is going great, by the way, folks. So, I hope you have a good summer this week. Yeah. I think the weather's going to be okay. Tomorrow, and tomorrow is supposed to be a stone cut. Like now, the sun is splitting the stones. For the next seven days, folks. I'll give you a forecast. I'll give you a forecast. Okay. Well, uh, in, in, in Ireland, that is like, you know, I don't know about the rest of the world. <laughs> well, yeah, of course. Yeah. Anyway, in Ireland, it's going to be Scorchio. A bit cloudy. Right, folks. <laughs> <laughs> I will leave you and I will put on the outro. I will see you uh, next Sunday, 2100 hours, if I don't have a surprise stream during the week, which is where I really want to do it. Thanks, Colonel Click. See you next time, folks. See you, folks. Bye for now. <laughs>